In this tutorial I will show you the fastest way to set up a virtual lab to practice your wireless hacks using a virtual machine. A virtual machine allows you to play with another operating system without leaving your current operating system. You have several options of different virtual machines. But for this tutorial I will use VMware Player. So let's switch to my computer and download VMware. Now, open up your browser and search for VMware Player and click on the first link and then select Download for Windows. When the download has finished, open the file and install the program. After the installation has completed, you should see a new icon on your desktop. Double click on this shortcut and you will be brought to this little menu. To test all the wireless attacks, I have installed Kali Linux into VMware because it has all the tools that I'm going to use pre-installed. To download Kali Linux, go to the Kali site and select Download Kali Linux. Here you have different ISO files. Just click ISO and wait for the download to complete. I will click Cancel because I have already downloaded. Next, open VMware and click on Create a new virtual machine and then look for your Kali ISO file. Click Next and here select Linux Debian 864 bit. Click Next and here you can give the name to your virtual machine and the location where your virtual machine will be installed. Click Next and in here you have disk capacity but you can increase it. And the second option is fine so click Next. And in here you can click the customize hardware button and change different settings. You can increase the memory and change the number of processor cores. When you are done just click close. Now I will click cancel because I have already created a virtual machine. So just select this Kali Linux from here and click play virtual machine. Now wait for a few seconds for the system to start. If you want to play with this virtual machine a little bit, feel free to explore. And just remember, anything you are doing here, it's never going to affect your host operating system. So, that's it for now. Thanks for watching and I will see you next time.